Hey everybody, it's Zach with The Mighty Electron and I am so excited about this video. I've been waiting probably about 14 years to post this video and it's because I'm happy to tell you, well, you, you may recognize that I'm not in the Highlander anymore. Um, I'm sitting in my new vehicle and by new, I mean used, but new to me vehicle and it's a Tesla. Finally got it, finally happened. So first of all, let me tell you about what I bought and then I'll tell you why I bought it. I got a 2014 Tesla Model S. It's an 85, it's not the P85, it's not the P85D, it's just a flat 85. Um, and with it being a 2014, it's got some bumps and bruises on it, which is just fine. Again, this isn't a pristine, never drive it in the rain, don't let the kids sit in it type car. This is a, this is gonna be my daily driver vehicle. And, um, I'm thrilled about it. I would have loved to do the 80, the uh, P85 and I would have absolutely loved to do the P85D, but uh, it just wasn't in the price range. With it being the 85, when it was brand new, this car had a range of 265 miles. Right now, fully charged, this car has a range of 240. So I'm pretty pleased about that. That was always my rule is I needed a minimum of 200 miles. That's why I didn't go for the 60. I think at this age, it just, I think I would have been about 190. It does have a clean title. So I have access to the superchargers because it somehow the sale was registered through Tesla before me. Um, it doesn't have access to free supercharging anymore, even though originally it did. However, it does have the free connectivity. Um, it's been upgraded to the MCU two, which I'm excited about. And all in all, I love it. Oh, uh, it had, when I bought it, it had 117,000 and change on it, 117,000 miles and a little bit more than that. Next thing, why did I buy it now? Because if you've been following the channel at all, you know that I only have four months worth of data on the spreadsheet, right? The whole point was to decide which one's going to be more profitable. Uh, profitable is the wrong word. Which one was going to save more money and really could I get into a Tesla for only spending maybe another $20, $30 a month? Uh, last month's numbers were, of course, all over the place. The numbers have been all over. And Tesla actually became the cheapest of the three vehicles that I'm tracking. That's the Tesla, the uh, Highlander that I own, and the uh, Honda Ridgeline, used Honda Ridgeline, because that was going to be kind of the backup vehicle once the Highlander finally gave up the ghost, which still hasn't happened, by the way. However, one of the reasons why I did move on this purchase is because the Highlander definitely is making some sounds to where I probably need to have put $1,500, maybe $2,000 into it, which I could have, and that vehicle probably would have gone another couple of years, or I could have just finally taken a leap and moved into this vehicle. Um, so with that being on deck, and then we just found a screaming deal on this car, who's a private seller, and... Uh, I think uh, I think he's happy with the sale price. I'm certainly happy with the sale price. And so just decided to, to pull the trigger and make that happen. I don't want this movie to be like a 30 minute, here's everything I love about the Tesla, but stay tuned, subscribe to the channel, uh, make sure and like these videos because I want, I'm over the next couple months, I'm going to be doing a bunch of short things about what I love about the Tesla, little things that I find new about it. And again, I know I'm probably the last person on YouTube to be making these videos because everybody else has had a Tesla forever. However, there are some pretty cool things and uh, I think you'll enjoy it. So if you are looking at getting a brand new Tesla, it's probably isn't the channel for you. However, if you're looking at getting a used Tesla because your other used car is about to die, then follow along and we'll find out together if this was a good purchase or not. All right, thanks everybody. We'll see you next time.